Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan. In this video, I will show you using AngularJS how to get the total sum of array values from a table column. I'm reloading the browser and here we got the final output. Notice we got the grand total sum of the marks using AngularJS. That's it. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. For this video tutorial, I am using Notepad++. Notice in this Notepad++ contains a simple HTML code with some header tags h1, h2 and horizontal line. Now before adding the arrays into a table using AngularJS, first we will check the basic output how it looks at designing part on the browser. And this is the output of that simple HTML code. At this moment, this page contains only header tags and the horizontal line. Now my aim is, first I will create an arrays using AngularJS. After that, I will bind that student array into a table. Then I will get the total sum of values of the marks using AngularJS. So when you are using AngularJS, the first thing we require the latest angular cdn link so search for latest angular js cdn and from the search results i'm selecting the angular.js in this angular.js website you can find different versions so I'm selecting the version 1.77. Come to the bottom. I required uh, uh, this is the file I require angular.min.js. Let's copy this one and add in the header section. Script source is equals to I'm closing the script tag. After that, after adding the angular.js now after the horizontal line i'm adding the table i'm closing the table inside this table tr i'm closing this tr table headers subjects table headers marks table headers i'm closing the next TR I'm closing this TD let's copy this and paste here now in this TDs I want to display the values from the arrays using AngularJS so in the script part I'm adding the script closing the script tag variable app is equals to angular dot module between double quotes i'm adding the angular application name which i'm adding in this table ng iphone app is equals to my app let's copy this one paste here comma and now we require the controller app dot controller is a function between double quotes. I'm adding the controller name in this table ng iPhone controller is a directive. The controller name is my controller. Let's copy this and paste here comma in the controller I'm adding function dollar scope Now inside this function I am adding the values dollar scope dot marks is a element is equals to the first one the column name is a subjects. Colon. 
the subject name is max comma the second column is a max I'm adding the max 45 comma copy this one the second subject I'm adding physics 65 computers 85 let's make it 80 80 social 35 let's add the semicolon that's it we have created some variables array variables into this angular js let's bind this into this table in the tr ng iphone repeat is equals to get total in i'm adding the max element after that after that in this td i'm adding the angular expression get total dot the first one is a subjects the second one is a get total dot marks copy this one and paste here that's it we have just binded this data subjects and marks into this table using angular js let's save this file we'll check the output I'm reloading the browser see here we got the data array list is binded into this table subject and marks now my next target is I want to get the total of this total marks at the bottom so let's write the code first we'll add some style to this table text align center and border of the table I want one after that I'm adding another TR I'm closing another TR it's a new row TD I'm closing this TD total marks the second column TD and TD to get the total marks of this marks column I'm adding in this second TR ng iphone init is a directive now in this ng init I'm adding the angular dollar parent dot the element total I'm adding here is equals to total plus get total dot marks after I get the total of all the marks I want to display in this second TD so I'm adding a an angular expression I'm adding the element total the grand total of the total marks I want to display in this in this expression the td style i'm adding style to this td color red that's it we have done the complete coding part let's save this file we'll check the final results on the browser i'm reloading the browser and here we got the final output notice we got the grand total some of the marks using angular js that's it